Hey everyone, it's Dr. Betcha here, and today I'm talking to you about trunk stability, okay? So what is your trunk, first of all? Well, your trunk is really kind of the lowest part of your spine, or your lumbar spine, or what you might just think of as your low back, okay? So as many of you may know who have hurt your low back before, um, sometimes this happens with activity. So we need to train your body for trunk stability, and that involves core muscles, muscles in your back, your pelvic floor, your diaphragm, and intra-abdominal pressure. So all of these components help stabilize your low back so that during physical activity and physical exertion, you are not going to have a low back injury. So not just abs after abs, crunches, 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 but looking at this full cylinder, this torso, your trunk, and getting some exercises that keep that spine in really good neutral position, again, to prevent injury during exercise or physical exertion. Take a look at some of these exercises.